Vartama. I am working as open source developer in Chipkit for past 3 months. Presently, I am going to talk about email validator. The email validator class validates that a string has a single at sign, a period in the domain name, and that the top level domain suffix has 2 or 2, 3, 4 or 6 characters. Syntax email validator. Common property for validate. One is enabled, second property, third one designer, fourth one is require, fifth one requires field error, sixth one source, seven one trigger, eight one trigger event. This is a common properties. So whatever you want, you can use these properties. Then email validate properties. One is invalid character error. Error message when there are invalid characters in the email address. Second one, invalid domain name. Error message when the suffix is not 2, 3, 4 or 6 characters long. Invalid IP domain error. Error message when the IP domain is invalid. Fourth one is invalid property in domain error. Error message when the there are continuous period in the domain. Fifth one, missing at sign error. Error message where there is a no at sign in the email address. Sixth one, missing period domain error. Seventh one, missing username error. Error message when there is no username. Eight is too many at sign errors. Error message when there is a more than at sign in the email address. Add user on package MS short controls. Add use methods. One is email validator is a constructor. So is it display the output. Events one is valid, second one is invalid. Even is dispatch when the validation is succeed. Invalid means dispatch when the validation is failed. Next I explain the code by using flux filter. Add user on test input, test input id email 1. Add user on button controls id equal to my button then you go to email validator. Source equal to get the input values email 1. Property equal to test missing at sign error. Missing at sign missing user name error missing in username so too many at sign error don't use more than one trigger my button trigger event is a click valid is a event alert or so this is a correct email id it will show the output then i had user one package ms.control in the alerts i show the output p at kids.com is a valid id means it display the output Validation is succeed. Then you have to type at symbol dot com. You have to click the button and display the error message missing in username. Then you have to more at symbol given. Validate means it gives a don't use more than one symbol. Then you are gmail dot com. This type of you given it display the error message missing in username. This type of errors is using coming. Finally, you do any number at gmail.com. This is a valid. It is play the output. This is the output. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you very much.